Welcome back to Infamous, or as my friends in the Three Amigos like to call it, Infamous. Of course. We when when infamous. we are more than famous. We are infamous. <laughs> and we are becoming relatively well known for being a good boy. Yeah. I've I use that right. phrase a lot, but you know, <laughs> I like doggo memes, I'm sorry. It's wholesome. It's we can... wholesome. There's enough bad shit going on down here, let's be <laughs> wholesome. That's what Infamous really needs is pork memes to, to keep it wholesome. Die! <laughs> oh. You are very lucky, my friend. And you'll stay there. Many of your own kind are not so lucky. Whoop. Nice. Go unleash a few more. There you go. Bugger off, please. Use your top weapon. That's what it's for. Remember, people are just going to keep respawning. Yes, but I also prefer not to have people shooting at me. True. You can't outrun most of the time. The hand changing thing just feels so foreign. Yeah. Like, it's not, it's not a bad thing. In fact, I think it's a relatively good idea, but it just feels foreign to do. Yeah. Because it's probably the only game that I know that it can do that. Oh, there's a few Metal Gear Solid you can. Really? Uh, the, the later ones. I was gonna say, not the ones I know. I know for sure it's in the fifth one. And I think, um, damn, we got him. I think also in Ground Zero. Okay. I'd assume if it was in Ground Zero, it'd be five, and vice versa. Yeah. Ah, we're in the safe zone. Sick. I think there weren't many things that didn't make the cut from Ground Zero. Yeah, it seemed fairly good at establishing what to expect. Mm. It's good, I can move around freely in here. It is nice. Got people still wounded though. Whoops. Nope, you're just... Oh. I'm on the street. You're just, uh... Now they're wounded. <laughs> Whoa! That was the wrong button. Also, uh, hang on. That was the wrong button. Have you seen? Oh dear. Uh, it's getting cold out there, especially at night. Do it takes to stay warm. Cut down trees, strip the wood off buildings, collect paper scavenge. You're an ass. Come back. If it heat, burn it. The old rules don't exist. Not anymore. Voice of survival out. Check out that bus stop. Resistance movement. Not quite. Look at the back of it. It's posters of you. Oh! Remember the same people putting up posters? You will actually see it. Uh oh. Whoa! 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 What in the? I didn't able... see any of that. Yeah, you gotta hear them. They they make out their noises. All I heard was. <laughs> you hear that? Was... No. Who's there? This is such a hostile world. Oh yeah. One of my favourite. Wouldn't call the tropes. I'd say a way you approach being a superhero. Being a superhero doesn't automatically solve all your problems. If anything, it should make your life harder. Mm. Because you're now managing... Like, it's it's like being the only person in the world to have a sense of smell. You know? Like that, that'd be hard to keep under wraps. And well, hard not to affect How would it change life. anything? It not change anything. You start reacting to things that no one else reacts to, all the time. You'll have instincts, feelings, that you can't suppress, and like you would visibly show. And people ask you why, they, why they're there. And that's just something simple. Now imagine that you're becoming a human battery, and you're throwing lightning bolts around. True. In an apocalypse, you are going to become very important, whether you like it or not. There we go. Much more reliable option. And the Zeke's place. Not fun now. Eh? Yeah, just working out the safest route. Ah, it don't matter too much. <laughs> and look! All the tar's gone from your head. And it's all gone from your, your lightning bolt. Hey! Your conduit bars. What they were called? Battery bars? I don't know what it's called. We'll call them whatever we want, damn it. 
What's up, Zeke? You can't turn that race fear over to the feds, man. Do I have a choice? Man, alive! Do you know what they'll do with something like that? Especially... You just enjoy television, Zeke. <laughs> What's your suggestion, Jedediah? We hide it under your couch. Only my mama calls me Jedediah. That's not important right now. Listen, I say we crack Three more? I thought it was three. Give everyone powers. You're a maniac. It's the only way to make sure we don't get screwed. Yeah. I think we're already screwed. Dude, you saw what one did to this city. You mentioned another one? Ah, Voltaire. Interesting. Yeah. I do not mind that quote. It's a good one. It's also to remember, remember his kind of philosophy, that guy. Yeah. He was an odd one. Substation in your GPS goal. Uh, shouldn't I be hunting for John in the race sphere? You need to look at the big picture. Every time you restore electricity to a section of the city, your powers escalate. I'd say that's a valuable use of your time. I'll be in touch once you get the substation back online. Hey, at least she's actually concerned about our growth and potential. That's Which something. Good. But uh, before I forget, Voltaire. Voltaire was very much a man who would justify doing the things that you want to do, like primal urges and stuff like that, is natural. And to resist those urges is to resist the kind of person that you are. So, for him, temptation wasn't so much just something that can happen to anyone. It's like your own urges. It's like your, your purest own, instinct. Your own identity trying to lead you. And if you fight that, you're fighting yourself. And if you hide behind things like, you know, civilized society or things like he generally looked down on that quite harshly. Also, is it a satellite disc? I'm, I'm probably giving a very bare bones description of Voltaire here, here but I'm just trying to summarize it quickly. Configuring satellite dishes across Empire City. When I asked what they planned on doing with the dishes, I was told to mind my own business. Because the dishes are relatively isolated and secure, I use them for my dead drops. No! Just a way over to the thing. Oh no, it's just a train. Yeah, it ain't moving. And there's no red dots on my mini map. Nope. You're all safe. Cool. Leg it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. You got the train for cover. Put it on both sides. That's right. So we're going into the dark zone again. Joy. It's all right. You should be safe up on the train tracks. Just gotta keep moving. Just leg it. I apologize for the sound of me putting my hands and twisting. <laughs> it's fine. Could be worse. You could be doing Pringles again. Yeah. I learned my lesson. I'm not gonna break my hand. But you can twist these. Well, one would hope. Yeah. Now you should be able to drop down and enter that subway station before they kill you. Whoa! Yep. Nope. There we go. So there we go. go. Jesus, they made that tight. It's, uh, well, I mean, you probably could have picked them all off, but we get them there. Hey, Moya, I'm down in the sewer. We should have the power back on in no time. Also, she's not mentioning the fact that when you restore power, the city generally, generally performs better. Or, you know, people are safer. Or there's less bad guys around, so that you get more powers. So, you know... Federal agent. Through and through. <laughs> Whoa! I mean, like, this always seems to be, like, the only good guy in the department, or just faceless bureaucrat. There doesn't yeah. seem to be much in between. So, what do we think our new power is going to be this time? I don't know. Maybe, like, a launching power? Yeah. For, like, a running jump? Ah! Yep. Grinding! Pretty awesome. Really helps with transport that one. That would be pretty sick. Grind on train tracks? Yeah. That's oh! Cool. Dude! And that gives the us a bit of launch as well. Yeah. Believe me, I'd love to. No idea where he's hiding, though. <laughs> I like you, Zeke. You're a good man. Now that's the Union Noggin. Kind 
fancy shit. Oh. Made it. Man with the shield. Okay. Oops. Didn't realize. Oh, can you melee? Oh, no, he's. Get shot the water a few times. Yeah, he's exploded now. He is deceased, James. Hmm? He's dead, Jim. Oh, right. <laughs> we got there eventually. I'm glad you like those ones. There's a lot of good ones that come from that. I remember myself. See what I get. But I gotta say though, I wanna bring it up again. It doesn't give you enough motivation to go bad, because so many enemies do not run in packs together, so them blowing up doesn't change a lot. Look, it looks cool, and I get that feeling like, you know, or, you know, you, you're a bad guy, you've got bad powers, and this is what it looks like when they're being used. Whoa! Water. And I and I dig that. I do. Nah, you're not climbing off that. Hang on. No, they won't they won't let you. Well then I'm just gonna die! No, you just gotta get on the, the ladders that are near them for the platform, remember? You just gotta go looking for. Can't see! Get in the water. I could not see a thing! <laughs> That's alright, we'll get there. How if far it was easy, that? everyone would be being a superhero. Oh, I'm back here. You're not that far away. In the doorway. Oh, he's gone. He's not in this combat camera anymore. On we go! Remember, there's no penalty for firing your, your lightning bolts. You can fire it as much as you like. Oh, I can? Yeah, absolutely. No, I mean... <laughs> I know, but that one I really wanted to do. Well, good on you. I was sitting in the water, I was like, I can't no. As long as I didn't explain myself in bed, that was uh, no. that was my concern. There's one more. Uh, he's, he's, he's in the water. The guy who killed me before. Yeah, he's in the water. He's right next to you. He's just on the water. So oh. just shock the water in front of you because he's dead. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, okay. That's how you kill him, man. Alright, okay. Alright, alright, okay. Oh, get! Oh. Instant karmic retribution. Karmic? I'm doing the good shit! <laughs> I mean... That's true. Well, I don't know what those noises were, so I'm gonna say karmic. What noises? The DRN. The multiple oh. rights. <laughs> don't speak that's, your language. That's Macklemore. Oh. <laughs> Irrelevant. <laughs> <laughs> to the, the levels of unlimited power! Can aim while you need to belong. Wanna get shocked! But have you noticed these guys also spew up the black stuff? No, I haven't. Yeah. See? You can just do it again. Shoot the water. Always, always. No. What? No. Oh, no. come on! They got you. They got you again. Rats! Yet. Can I hit them there? Sort of. Kinda. He's down there, man. He's not, he's not on the road. Look at Barry's ball. You, on the other hand. Yup! Oh, 
Don't, don't shoot them while you ride the line. I just wanted to get a head start. Bam. Yeah! What are you making, mate? You seem like it in place. Mm. And we're at the end. <gasps> Whoa! That back twist, though. Nicely done. Try hitting the box itself. There we go. Lovely! And hopefully this entire little island is now restored. Hopefully. And, if memory serves... Oh wait, no, sorry. No, <laughs> no, no, I mean, it's a small detail, but we can do it later. Alright, well, I think the last one we should probably do is check our powers, see if we can do anything. Yeah. We might be able to get that lightning bolt. Hey! We can. Hell yeah. A well earned lightning bolt. Fantastic. So what comes after that one again? I can't remember. Um, restoring. That's pretty good. So, if we. Yeah. Ah, I'm, I'm glad. And I will be happily testing that out in the next section. So, I will see. We will catch you guys in the next episode. Yeah. See you next time. Things are getting brighter. Was that a pun? Puns? <laughs> <laughs>